Hey everyone, Flash from Flash Hobbies here, and my China wheels finally came in as well. These are the 1.9 um, bead locks that I ordered off of eBay. I will leave a link in the description below so you can see where I got these from. Very nice, just like if, uh, if you've seen my other video for the 2.2s, they are a traditional bead lock with, I believe, five piece, including the hub. Um, you have the front face, the, the back plate, the hub, and then the main ring. And then you also have the the front bead lock part here. Um, if you saw my last video, I was working with these BF Goodrich uh, KR2 1.9 tires from Proline, and I'm gonna go ahead and install these on here just so you have a look and see how it's gonna all play out. So I'm just gonna go ahead and install these on one of them just so you have an idea on how it looks like. I want to bore you by putting. <clears throat> every single screw in for you so what I'm gonna do is just talk about the wheel for a little bit um, these are 1.9 beadlock wheels they are traditionally made for a rock crawler so are these tires but uh, I'm using them for the custom trophy truck that I have from uh, Elvis RC if you haven't checked them out he makes some sick rigs so make sure you do that and, and just ask them about pricing because it is different depending on what you want because these are pretty much made to order um, so if you want something custom, <clears throat> excuse me, if there's anything in particular that you want on there, he can do it for you. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty nice. Um, the aluminum feels good. It doesn't really feel like any type of cheap, cheap aluminum. Not that I can tell of anyways. Um, <clears throat> these are supposed to replicate like the KMC type style and they have a good weight to them overall. Um, it does have about 34 pieces, not including the actual bead lock. If you're counting everything, I'd say at least 40 pieces is what you're looking at. But um, I'm going to go ahead and assemble it onto the tire and everything. So we're just going to do a little fast forward. It took me about <clears throat> close to 10 minutes from start to finish. Um, everything went on pretty good. Um, doesn't seem like there's any, I mean, the pressure is really there. I'm really pulling right now, and it's not really pulling off. So I would hope that these hold up to 2S because that's what I'm going to put them at. I don't think I'll be running 3S on them. Not too sure. But um, I like. I, I don't think I mentioned the price. I got the bead locks. I have four of them for about uh I want to say under $60 shipped from eBay and again I'll put uh, the description down below this is the part number but I don't even know what company or anything this is it's just some China knockoff wheels but um, like I've mentioned in my other videos I can't spend or justify spending $200 on RC wheels when I can't even spend that much on my real car so <laughs> um, for the for the price that I would have paid for one set I got some 2.2 for my flash uh, trophy truck and I got these as well so I'm very happy even if they strip at the hub at the most I could buy a vanquish hub and just put it on there and it still saves me money so I, I can't complain I'm very happy so now let's go ahead and fit them onto the truck and see how it looks all right and here we have it installed onto the truck the offset is good nothing is rubbing um, so what do you guys think I think this is going to be a nice addition to the truck. Um, right now, it's still a work in progress. There's still a couple parts missing. Um, still missing like the hub and spindle. And um, I did manage to get the servo in. I know this is supposed to be about the wheels, but this is just a quick little update. Um, there's still little parts here and there that are missing, but um, the wheels was definitely a big part for me because um, expense-wise, wheels and tires, or rims and tires, if you want to say it's you know the whole combo is. It gets a little pricey with these because you do have to get six. So I do have two more on order, um, two more of these independently, which you can buy, and then a set of the wheels or tires that I ordered from Tower Hobbies. So um, let me know what you guys think. If you have any comments, questions, or concerns, leave them in the comments below. If not, we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys.